Good morning. You're watching World Without Rule. Uh, another beautiful day here in Southern Virginia. Today, I'm going to attempt to start some raised beds. What say you, Miney? Yeah, she doesn't care. So, these panels are five feet long by two and a half feet wide. So I'm going to fill these with wood. They'll be going horizontally. And so they'll be two and a half feet tall. I will fill them with rotted wood, similar as I did to the one in the back, if you saw that video. Make a Hugo culture-ish bed. Just kind of bring it over here. I took these, most of them were leftover scraps. And I cut out a section, so these will go in the corners. And I'm going to overlap them and screw three panels together. So that would be 15 feet, you know, minus whatever the overlap, two, three inches, so six inches. And it would be 14 and a half, roughly, feet. That's the plan. And so... All I got is my cell phone, I'm by myself, so there's really no way to film me doing it. And beside, who really wants to watch me screw a bunch of stuff together? Explain it to you how I'm going to do it, and when, I, when and if I get the first one together, I'll show it to you. So, to screw the metal together, I'm using a half inch tech screw, it's got the little drill bit on the end. I may pre-drill the holes just to save battery power. I don't know if it's going to save me any. And I'm using an inch and an eighth drywall screw screw into the wood. All right, I got the first one built. Roughly 5 by 14, 15. Put a mesh in the bottom. Hardware cloth. Keep the rodents and different critters out of here. Next I'm going to fill it with wood and then chips. All right, the final layer of wood, ready for the final layer of wood chips, and then top it off with compost. All right, making progress. Put the mulch in or the half composted wood chips. Maybe not quite half, but it's on its way. Some pieces of cardboard I laying around. So I put five loaders. I don't know how big the bucket is. Five buckets with chips on there. Probably almost could take another one. Maybe I'll let it rain if it's get rain in the next few days. Settle in, walk on it a little more, top it off with another bucket or two. So that's the LA 364 loader. Somebody probably knows how many yards or half a yard or. Alright, first bed is completely done. We got the compost in. Final layer. So the bed is a little bit over 14 feet long. There are three five foot panels, but I overlapped them a few inches. So I think three, so it came out to six, roughly six inch between the two seams. So we're down to about 14 and a half feet by five feet. And I'm gonna put three feet in between. I did put three feet in between over here, actually a little more because once I finish these rows out with berries along the fence, they'll come out a little bit of space. And I think just to be able to get a wheelbarrow and whatever, I'm gonna put three feet in between. I laid it out. If I put three feet in between, I can still get two more of these beds and not encroach into my tractor gate over there. Future tractor gate, right now it's just an opening. <laughs> And then I'm going to put a fourth one this way. 
So I'll end up with four beds that are five foot wide by 15 and a half foot long. And so my goal is at least to get at least one more done this season. I've got a pile of stuff that can go in there. I got plenty more in back. We did take down a maple tree out in front that was a little bit of rot in the bottom. And so that's it. Food forest is moving forward. And uh, I don't know if I did this in a previous video. Maybe you can kind of see them. I'll walk down by the trailer. I got a couple of peach trees. And we're just about at sunset. It is an absolutely gorgeous day. I know I've been saying that a lot. Praise God. It has been true a lot. So these are the two peach trees I picked up. And those are going to go in the food forest. And then we had to cut down that maple in front, as I was saying, because it was rotted. So my wife saw this red Japanese maple, or just red maple. It's not Japanese. And she wanted to get that. So we're going to plant that in the front. There's the next grow bed in the process of being constructed. Thanks for watching. God bless you.